everyone is probably familiar with the fact that the CC apps, including Photoshop CC, are things you can no longer buy. You have to rent them at great cost. Mm -hmm. You know, okay, I disagree with that. But they also always had Photoshop and Premiere elements, and those were perpetual license products where you would buy it for 100 bucks a piece or maybe get both for 140 or whatever, and uh, you could just use it forever, essentially. But the last two years, they have switched uh, explicitly to a three-year license. That's it. So I'm sorry, but you, you're licensing this for, this, you just paid for a subscription for three years. So yep. if you paid 100 bucks for Photoshop Elements, that means you're paying 33 bucks a year, and then you get to go buy it again in three years. Like you're, That's a subscription. So Affinity, I, I like them because you pay for it, and you could use it forever, whatever. And then about a month, a month, month and a half ago, Affinity went dark. Um, I should I should add, sorry, uh, Canva acquired Inf Affinity earlier this year, I believe. And one of the big promises was like, guys, we're not going to subscription, don't worry. And then last, last week came and it was the day. And what they announced was they now have one app called Affinity. It's all three of the apps in one thing. It's Windows, Mac, and it will be on iPad soon. And it's just free. There's hmm. no catch. This is a good news story. I'm confused. That's yeah, it is confused. a good news story. And there is a catch in a sense, like they have AI features that you would need a Canva subscription to access. But all of the core features, the, the features I use anyway, are all there. But anyway, this is just worth looking at. I would take a look. It's free.